If you've ever been to Beaver Creek Resort, you know that this isn't exactly roughing it. As the third time host of the World Alpine Ski Championships, Beaver Creek is unrivaled when it comes to mountain hospitality. But if you're looking for a place to stay where comfort and privacy reign supreme, there's one place that's truly above the rest. Hi, I'm Glenn Thayer, and I'm gonna take you inside the very private and luxurious world of Chateau Beaver Creek. My arrival yesterday was by car, but it felt as though I'd been transported back in time. I've not seen this kind of magnificence in architecture since I was last in Europe. Let's just say they don't build them like this anymore. I and mean, even if they could, you'd be hard pressed to find a vacation home with an easier way to ski in and ski out. Let's go inside. I'm not sure if you were counting, but I was. I was 20 steps from the snow to my very own ski locker, complete with dryers for my ski boots. It just doesn't get better than this. Each morning, the staff gets a wood fire going in the fireplace, prepares the coffee and tea service, and during peak season, they provide a hearty continental breakfast for those who want to get an early start. Should the weather turn a bit too cold and snowy, it's nice to know that all of this is waiting for you when you return. Come this way. I'll show you what I've got planned for the afternoon. As you can see, there's a fully equipped fitness room with a state-of-the-art cardio theater and strength training machines. But beyond these doors is the Chateau's private spa. Tanya here is going to show you the women's locker room while I get ready for my massage. Both the men's and women's locker rooms are complete with steam rooms and private hot tubs. The spa is equipped with private changing rooms and lockers so that you can prepare for a spa treatment or simply head to the pool. Glenn, your therapist will come find you in about 10 minutes. Is there anything I can get you in the meantime? Oh, I think I'm good, thanks. Uh, but maybe you can take our guests upstairs and give them the grand tour. Of course. And I also wanted to let you know you'll be interviewing one of our owners in the library tonight at 5. And your dinner reservation for Splendido is confirmed for 6. Thanks, Tanya. Okay, I know what you're thinking. But I gotta be well prepared for this interview. We'll just call it market research. <laughs> 